Today, I rewrote the career at Timo Werner. I liked it a lot. Yes, boys, welcome back to another Rewrite Friday. Thank you, Jesus! <laughs> welcome back to the series where a player's career absolutely doesn't matter because we just write it ourselves. Yes, sir! But you see, today's installment, we do have Timo Werner. If this is the first time you guys are writing a rewrite, basically what we do is take a player's career and forget like it ever happened because in this generation, in this world, they don't exist. But basically, what we try to do is always take the opposite route the player has taken today. Interesting. Most of the time we usually change the position or we change the club they started off at. In today's video, we're not changing Timo Werner's position. He is staying in that striker position, but we're playing for Stuttgart's biggest rivals that are in FIFA, which is Carl Schurer SC. What did he say? Hey. Oh. That was completely wrong, but that team it is. This team is in the second league of the Bundesliga. Not only that, but the format is we go nine seasons into the future and take account his goals, his assists, and his trophies. But anyways, let's get started. Let's go. Boys, here we have the probably the lowest rated rewrite we have ever had in this channel. A 61 rated for Timo Werner, which was his first ever FIFA rating in FIFA 14 at 18 years of age. His potential as well as an 85, that was his potential in FIFA 14. But yeah, boys, like I said, we're basically gonna follow Timo Werner's career, making the decisions for him. So if we wanna move to a club whenever we want, we can go ahead and do that. With great power comes great Big booty bitch. But anyways, boys, before we do start, make sure to leave your predictions down below. How good do you think Timo Werner would do in this rewrite? Okay, boys, to get started, we need to give Mr. Fortnite a development plan. So, what are we going to give him today? I don't even know why I hyped this up. We're always giving Poach at the beginning because we want him to score tons of goals. Okay, boys, this is going to be one of the more challenging rewrites yet because he is so low rated. But let's see what he can do in his first season in the second Bundesliga. You know what? I'm backing Timo Werner to at least reach a 94 rating. Even though he started off solo, I'm really backing him today. So let's go ahead and sim to the end of the first season and see how Timo Werner does. Okay, boys, we have reached the end of the first season. It's time to see how Timo Werner did in his first season when with his German team because I'm not going to pronounce that name again. Okay, boys, they avoided relegation by three points Well, the relegation playoff, so that's not too bad considering the team is not too good. As for the DFB Pokal, why am I even checking, man? I know we didn't even win round one, so there's no point. Why am I still? Why am I still here? I just, I'm just really curious who we lost to. We lost to Leipzig, of course. Okay, boys, not too bad growth for Timo Werner in the first season. Plus four, making him 65. He is getting close to the players around him, around the same rating. So hopefully, he scored at least 10 goals. 10 goals should be good for him. Okay, boys, our boy Timo Werner has played 31 games, seven goals and one assist. And you know what? For 61 rating, who is now at a 65, that's actually not too bad. So we'll take it this season. I play. A lot of uh, Fortnite. Okay, boys, this is season number two. And Timo Werner grew to 66. Boys, I'm feeling, I'm cooking up something special here. I'm feeling something special here. He's going to have his breakout season this year and probably promote this team to the Bundesliga. Very false. And should I should I even show you guys what development plan I'm going to choose? Yes, we're going to keep it at Poacher. You've become so predictable. Because his finishing is only at a 68. It's going to get better. And you know what? I'm setting a goal. I'm setting goals now from now on for each season. So this season, I mean, yeah, this season... His goal is 10 goals, okay? As long as he gets 10 goals, I will be happy. If he doesn't, well, there isn't much I can do, okay? The whole point of this video is do the best for him. So, hopefully he does well. Let's go ahead and go to the end of Season 2. Hopefully, he gets 10 goals at least. Okay, boys, we have reached the end of Season 2. Let's see how Timo Werner has done this season. Oh, no, boys. It's relegation for Timo Werner's team. So, he's definitely leaving no matter what. I mean, I could have him the Bundesliga 3, but you know what? I'm pretty sure he's at least a 70 now, but... Relegation, bro. Yeah, people go out. There's no point. Yeah, we didn't win it. How somehow Freiburg won it. What did I say, boys? Timo Werner, 70 rating, going up from a 66 to a 70. He's now one of the better strikers. He, probably the best striker in this league, to be honest. But let's go ahead and see how good he did. Boys, he missed out on my goal by by one goal, man. Nine goals and one assist for Timo Werner. I mean, it's not. It's hard for him with this team around him doing trash, but. Hopefully, we transfer list him. If we get an interesting offer, then we'll move where he'll play. If not, we'll probably just stay here, to be honest. Bundesliga 3 would do him well. He'll score tons of goals. But 70 rated now, 9 goals is still not too bad, man. I play a lot of uh, Fortnite. Okay, boys. Season number 3 for Timo Werner. Like I said, we're going to go ahead and try to get rid of him because this club just relegated. But if we don't get an offer where it's a pretty decent team and he, where he won't, if he won't play, there's no point in transferring him to that club. So, the winning plan for now, what should we put him? It's it's gonna be poacher, man. This I don't even know why I go to the screen. Okay, boys, we've gotten a really good offer first time of asking. Okay, SDI Bar are in the second league of the Spanish league. Yes, we're going to another second division, but they just relegated. But they're a strong team, so that means they should promote in the first season if Timo Werner does his job. So you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and send Timo Werner to Spain. Why not, man? Okay, boys, as you can see, we have joined SDI Bar in the second division of La Liga. And you know what, boys? This team is not looking too bad, so I think we can go straight back to the Bundesliga this season. What? Okay, boys, development plan is going to be one more time at least 
a poacher because he needs to be at least 85 and above or 82 and above in finishing so he can score lots of goals and after that we'll probably do mobile striker complete striker target man and all that stuff okay boys this is the first time Werner moves in his career he's gone to the completely different country in Spain can he dominate the Spanish segundo division and take back Ibar into La Liga let's go ahead and find out Okay, boys, we have reached the end of season three. It's time to find out if Timo Werner sent him back into La Liga. Okay, boys, as we scroll up, I'm hoping they got automatic promotion because I don't want to deal with playoffs and they're in the playoffs, but boys, so we need to check right now if they made it to La Liga in the playoffs. But if not, to be honest, I wouldn't mind staying here another season. But by Spain, however, obviously, we weren't going to win it. I just want to see how far we made it. Round of 16, lost 1-0 to Villarreal. As for the Copa de Ascenso, as you can see, they lost in the semi, so they have to stay in La Liga 2 for another season. However, Timo Werner already a 75 rating. You know what? We might actually leave because uh, this team is very, very old, and I, I don't, I don't trust this team, man. So we're probably gonna leave next season, even though Fiorentino's class. But the keepers, man, oh my god, they're trash. Yeah, we're definitely leaving next season. But 75, a plus 5 for Timo Werner this season. And Timo Werner has had his breakout season. 17 goals, completely skipped 10. Hey, that's pretty good. And went straight for 17. Zero assists though, however. But it's a very good season for him. He is going to leave because this team is going to shit. Okay, Give my body shut the okay so another great season from Timo Werner. He's 21 years old now. Surely he's going to grow way faster now. I play... A lot of uh, Fortnite. Okay, boys, this is season number four. And as you can see, he has potential to be special. A 90 plus potential for Timo Werner. 75 rated, 20 years old. He is leaving SDI bar today. It's time to go! Okay, boys, so I've received an offer. I know you guys may be tired of going to the Premier League, but I was looking for an ambitious project for Timo Werner. And Crystal Palace is an ambitious project. They have a lot of young players in their squad that would do really well for Timo Werner. So you know what? Let's go ahead and go there, man. Let's see how he does there in the Premier League. Okay, boys, it is season four, and look at this. Timo Verne has joined Palace, and look at this side, man. It's actually a really good side. Okay, boys, and the fact that Lofan is here is actually really good, okay? I said that Crystal Palace is a project, and it actually was, okay? Eberiche Eze may not be here anymore, but they have replaced a lot him with a lot of young talents. Timo Werner could potentially stay in the side for the rest of his career. But anyways, as for the development plan, he still has potential to be special. What should we give him, man? I don't even know. Should we continue with Poacher? No, he has 87 finishing. Let's give him something else. Let's give him some dribbling, man, okay? His dribbling is really bad. Okay, boys, it's his first season in the Premier League. Let's go ahead and sim to the end of season four. Hopefully, he can do really, really well in this Crystal Palace side. Okay, boys, we have reached the end of season four. I'm hoping for at least a mid-table finish, maybe even Europa League or Conference League football. Let's see what happened. Okay, boys, the good thing is that they didn't relegate. Did they finish in the top 10? And yes, they have. Where did they finish? Ninth place. They almost made it to European football. Four points behind Newcastle and 10 points behind Manchester United in seventh. Okay, as for the FA Cup, did they possibly win this? I doubt it, man. Did they make at least a cup run here in the FA Cup? They lost to Millwall on penalties, bro. Millwall, as for the Carabao Cup, no win. Uh, once again, they who did they lose to? Arsenal. Bro, it's another plus five for Timo Werner. This man is growing insane. I told you he's going to reach at least a 94. I I'm calling it he's reaching 94. But look at this squad. Everybody's growing. Bro, this team will probably play Champions League football if we let Timo Werner stay here. But 80 rating is really amazing. But boys, the question is, did Timo Werner back it up with goals? And he has done 11 goals in the Premier League. It's actually not too bad because Orellano did shine in this squad. But 11 goals is still not too bad for his first season in the Premier League. His first time playing in the top flight division. So that's really well. Also going to plus five is absolutely amazing, man. I play... A lot of uh, Fortnite. Hey boys, season number five, and he's already grown a plus one again, boys. I'm feeling a breakout season here in the Premier League. I'm feeling Europa League football, fifth place for Crystal Palace this season. This squad is absolutely amazing. They just need to keep together and grow together. Development plan, what are we going to give him this season? He is now 22 years of age, 81 rating is not too bad. I think we have to keep his dribbling a little bit more, his finishing. Can we give something with his finishing and dribbling? No, we cannot. You know what? Let's keep him on mobile striker, man. Okay, boys, we're going to save him to the end of season five. Still no trophy for Timo Werner in his career, but he's about to reach 50 goals. Hopefully, he can get a 15-plus goal season and win a trophy. Like that's ever going to happen. Okay, boys, we have reached the end of season five. Something big is going to happen. I just know it, man. What do you mean by that? Okay, boys, as long as they don't finish in the bottom 10, I'm fine, okay? Because this team is growing together, okay? Did they finish between 10th to 7th? No, boys. I think they have confirmed European football. Did they finish in 6th? Bro, I swear, if they finished fifth and I caught it. Bro, they've actually finished. They've actually finished fifth place. They missed out on the top four by four points. We have Europa League football confirmed. That's insane. I can't believe I caught that, bro. But FA Cup, did they win it? And no trophy for Timo Werner just yet. They lost. Oh my god, round four. Really? They lost in the. Okay, not even. Round three in the first round to Nottingham. As for the Carabao Cup, did they win that? No, there's no chance, bro. 
Crystal Palace are not in the need to win trophies right now. I hope Timo Werner eventually wins the trophy, but they lost to Tottenham. Timo Werner is an 84 rated in the fifth season. Oh, let's go! That's class! Oh, he's absolutely amazing. Fofana's injured though, that kind of sucks. But look at this team, man. Bro, it's a team full of wonder kids. Oh no, this team is going to be playing Champions League football soon. However, the bench is pretty shit though. Hey boys, did he have his breakout season this season? And 17 goals. I'll take that as a breakout season. Almost 20. His most ever goals. What well, tied for his most ever goals. He scored 17 at Ibar. 17 in the Premier League though is really impressive. Now at an 84, surely this team is going to go far in the Europa League next season. Not only that, but qualify for Champions League football next season. I play... A lot of uh, Fortnite. Okay, boys, she's in number six. He's still at an 84. Didn't grow up, but he is playing with Germany, which is something really good already. But this team, like I said, I can't get over this team. Is doing really well right now, but let's go ahead and go to his development plan. At this point, he's looking like a superstar. His shot power is 97. His attacking position is at a 99. We have to improve his shot again, okay? I know it's very, very low right now, but... 87 and needs to be an 89 okay we need to get him or should we improve something else his strength is really weak you know what let's go for target man it's still improving his finishing but it's focusing a lot on the physical okay boys it's taking six seasons but for the first time in vernon's career he has european football but still no trophy to his name six seasons in i think this is the longest a player has gone without a trophy in this rewrite but hopefully they win something i'm feeling they're gonna win something and possibly get champions league football this season i'm being serious i'm being serious okay boys it's the end of season six please tell me we've won something okay boys i'm assuming they finished in the top eight and yes they have please tell me they at least secured europa league football Ah, oh, seventh place does that secure confidence in football I i'm still down to stay here i'm i'm down for this project okay boys but they have finished in seventh place as for the FA cup did they win that possibly they lost in the final to liverpool verna could have won his first trophy of his career but liverpool have denied that Carabao cup did they win that though no what did they lose bro oh they, they probably lost in the Carabao cup my teams always do bad like they always do bad every time we do a rewrite yeah they lost to tottenham in the round three as for the europa league please tell me they won that okay boys they're in group b hopefully they won it okay they've won the group five wins one draw okay round of 16 who did they face did they win they beat moscow 4-2 quarterfinals they lost to inter milan 4-3 bro come on bro boys team over has got about another plus five from an 84 to an 89 look at this team okay maybe anderson lets him down but wait he's already an 84 bro okay ferguson needs to work on himself because he's the only one that's not 80 rated in the starting lineup but this team is insane team of is insane Boys, and this Timo Werner's best ever season. Ice in the fucking veins, mate! May not have been the top goal scorer at the club with Orellano at 29 goals, but Timo Werner picks up 22 goals. His best ever season. Five assists as well. It's been a while since he had some assists. I think he went three seasons in a row without an assist, but Harvey Elliott, 17 and 17. That's actually insane, but the video is about Timo Werner. Great season from Timo Werner. His best season yet. I play a lot of uh, Fortnite. Okay, boys, season number seven. He has remained at 89. No 90 for him just yet, but boys... You guys are probably yelling at me to leave, but no, I, I do not want to leave this team. Look at this team, man. Give it a season. Give it one more season. I know it's season seven. He has yet to win a trophy. But I think, look, I, I'm risking it all to not win any trophies to win the Champions League in the last season. Okay, I'm going to risk it. Make this video interesting. Ferguson needs to work on himself. As long as he works on himself, everybody else is growing very fast. So hopefully, Timo Werner can lead them to the Champions League this year. Boys, we're going to go ahead and keep him at target, man. He still needs to work on his strength and his other physical stats. Okay, boys, let's go ahead and sim to the end of Season 7. I believe they're in the Conference League, but if not, 100% they're reaching the Champions League. That squad is way too strong to not be in the Champions League next season. So, like I said, I'm going to risk it all. I'm going to keep him here at Palace probably for the rest of his career. And hopefully, we can win that Champions League, bro. Okay, boys, we have reached the end of Season 7. Boys, I know I said it a couple seasons ago. I was feeling something special, and something did happen. Champions League football, it has to be. There's no way they didn't get Champions League football this season. Okay, boys, I don't even know why I go to the relegation dogfight. They're top 6, 100%. Yes, they're top 6. Did they finish in 5th place? Did they miss out on Champions League football? No, they haven't been. They're in the top 4. Okay, did they finish in 3rd? Boys, did they win the league title? No way this Palace side won the league title, and... They miss out on the title by two points, bro. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! But it's Champions League football. I caught it, man. Okay, they have to have at least one an FA Cup or Carabao Cup. Surely, or the Conference League. They lost in the final to Man United. Carabao Cup. Did they lose the final again? No, they lost in the semis to Palace. Conference League, please tell me they won it. Okay, boys, they're in Group B. Please tell me they passed. And yes, three wins and three draws, 12 points to finish in first. Round of 16. They lost to Stuttgart. Their Conference League, their European journey was ended early. But boys, there's no reason to be sad. We have Champions League football and Timo Werner's a 92, boys. 
We're not even close to the end. There's two more seasons left, and he's at a 92. Harvey Elliott's at a 90. Oriano at 89. Oli's 88. Gilmore at a 90. Kakura at 87. Lafon 88. Guehi 85. Fofana 86. Ferguson has gone all the way up to an 83 from a 77. That's outrageous. And Hickey at an 85. Okay, boys. Timo Werner has achieved 100% his best ever season. This is what he does! 33 goals and 4 assists. Dude, no. They have to win a Champions League, okay? I don't care if we don't win a league title, a Carabao Cup, FA Cup, whatever. We have to win the Champions League. We've already won our first ever Champions League in the channel with Anthony Martial. Can we do it in back-to-back -back rewrites and win another Champions League? This has to happen. Timo Werner, please lead this side to a Champions League either in the next season or in the last season. I play a lot of uh, Fortnite. Okay, boys, season number eight, the second to last season of this video 92 for timo Werner is absolutely insane guys it's taking us eight seasons but we finally have champions league football in our belts you know what i could have had champions league football way earlier but i wanted him to stay in this palace side and perform here as for the development plan we're just gonna put poetry he cannot grow anymore at this point okay boys it's do or die in these last two seasons yet to win a trophy but i do not care he has to win the champions league that's just the ultimate goal of this video always is to try have the best career but the champions league is the main goal please timo Werner. Achieve this for the team. Achieve this for us. We left you here, Crystal Palace, to be part of this project, and this project is coming to an end. Come on, let's win the Champions League. Okay, boys, it's the end of season eight. Please, Timo Werner, please tell me you won the Champions League, or at least something, man. Okay, boys, definitely in the top ten, top five. Yes, boys. Okay, top four. Okay, did they finish in third? Boys, did the Palace finally win the league title and? Let's go boys, they've done it. And they won it by six points, beating Spurs to the title. Okay, can they win a domestic treble though? FA Cup was won by Tottenham again. Damn, Tottenham have been dominating this video. But they lost to Arsenal in the round six. Carabao Cup, did they win it? Let's go boys, they have won a domestic double. But it's going to be a treble because I know they have won a Champions League. Okay boys, they're in Group G. Please tell me they passed. And first place in a tough group, man. Inter Milan and Bayern Munich. CSK Moscow is a drag, but... Damn, they finished with 13 points, one point above Bayern Munich, and two, three points above Inter Milan. Round of 16, did they win? And they lost to Milan 4-1, man. Come on, okay. One more season, they have to win it for sure. Okay, Timo Werner grew up plus one at this point. I don't expect him to grow anymore. Ferguson. Oh, <laughs> what happened to him? Two seasons ago, he's a 77. Then he went to an 83. Now he's at an 89, boys. Thank God he grew. That's exactly what we needed, man. He had a worse season than last year, but 27 goals is no easy feat as well. No matter what, he still had a great season. They won the league title. These goals are getting spread around little by little, but we have one last season. Timo Werner, can you achieve a 40-goal season? I think only one person has done that, and it was Anthony Martial. Can he please achieve a 40-goal season? Would be insane. In the Premier League, not only that, but can they win the Champions League in the last season? I play... A lot of uh, Fortnite. Okay, boys, it's the final season. In season three, we decided to leave Ibar after failing to reach La Liga. We have joined Palace and we said it would be a project, and it has been. We have stayed here, and I said I do not care what we want. We've still won two trophies to this day last season, winning the league and the Carabao Cup, I do believe. But, boys, it's time to win the Champions League this season. At this point, our development plan is pointless. He will not grow past the 93. I was close to my prediction, though, 94. I mean, he could still grow to 94, but I doubt it. But, boys, it's time to see. Can Timo Werner lead this Palace side to the Champions League? Can we finally win? Can we win a Champions League back-to-back -back in rewrites? Okay, boys, we have reached the end of the season. The end of the final season. Please tell me we won the Champions League, bro. Okay, boys, starting from the bottom of the table. There's no way we finished in the bottom below sixth place. Okay, fifth place. No. Did we win the league title again? And yes, we have back-to-back -back league titles. Okay, domestic treble. Okay, can we show that we win that? No, we lost to Tottenham, bro. Tottenham are actually really good in these series, okay? FA Cup, did we win it? No, Man City win it. Carabao Cup, please, please. No, boys, only the league title to our name. But surely, the Champions League is ours because it's written in the stars. Okay, boys, we established in this channel that it took nine months for us to win a Champions League. Martial won it last week. Surely, we have to win it again, okay? And back-to-back -back rewrites. We have won the group. 13 points. We beat Milan and Bayern. Another group with that. Round of 16. We lost last time. And we beat Leipzig 4-3. Quarterfinals. We beat Madrid 4-2. We're in the final, boys. Versus Barcelona. No, no, no. There's no way we won. There's no way we won. Barcelona are goaded in these rewrites, bro. They're goaded in every sims that we do. Every time we're past season five, Barcelona just win everything. Boys, please tell me. Did we win the Champions League? We wasted our time here at Palace. There's no way we didn't win, Alan. Let's go, boys. We actually won it, boys. We've done it. Timo Werner has won the Champions League. I don't care what you guys say. And that he misses every single shower or anything. He's goaded, man. He won his Champions League. Martial and Timo Werner, two meme strikers, have won as the Champions League, bro.
But boys, my prediction was wrong. He did not finish at 94. But look at this insane squad, man. I'm so glad. Ferguson, bro. What a comeback from Ferguson. Going from a 77 to a 90. Bro, eight players in the starting 11 reached a 90. Hickey was off by one. Fofana off by two. And Gwaki off by three. We could have had a full 90-11 from these players that you guys never even seen the rewrites. These players just did amazing. And boys, yes, he's done it as well. It's the perfect end. I know. I think this has to be the best. This has to be the best rewrite we have ever done. I know Martial won more trophies, but bro, everything was perfect. I predicted that we'd win the Champions League in this project, and we have. Not only that, but I said, he can he finish with 40 goals in his last season? And he has, bro. This rewrite has been absolutely insane. Okay, boys, taking a look at Timo Werner's final stats. Started off at a 61, finished off at a 93, playing for that one German team, and then playing for SDI Bar, playing for Palace. Only three clubs in his career. Man scored 185 goals, 21 assists, and four trophies. May not have won as much trophies as other players, but boy, did he do amazing. Yes, that is the end of today's video. If you guys did enjoy, you guys know exactly what to do. Click that like button and that sub button. Our new goal is 10,000 subscribers, but if you guys don't want to subscribe, it's completely fine. We're just trying to aim high so we can finish, so we can just go high, okay, boys? But I've been enjoying this time at the channel. We're reaching one year in this channel in a couple months, so I'm glad you guys have been part of this journey. Make sure you always do the things that you love, the things that make you happy, and just be yourself, man. It's been your boy, Edgar. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice day, and chamos.